abstract, dreamlike, very bright and colorful world um, connected to what seems to be kind of an all-seeing eye or some sort of eye symbol. Um, there are various flashes between these bright colors in the dreamlike landscape and then moments of dullness which might maybe be um, evil or reality kind of a certainly a contrast from the um, more abstract utopian feeling um, that we're receiving from these bright colorful scenes um, I noticed that this project was completed by a single individual who did all of the animation and um, music uh, and concept building everything on their own um, which I thought was very impressive um, overall I was uh, brought this short film brought a smile to my face I was entertained for the brief couple of minutes that I was watching it I really enjoyed the coloration of this piece the opener with the animated characters in pastels, uh, creative little characters whose movements and the action was in sync with the music. And I really like the transition into the neon colors as we see the spacemen floating around and lost in space, little tears in the eyes. I laugh so hard in this one time of dialogue where the character says it's too much and I'm going home and off he goes up into the sky. It was so comical. This filmmaker has a real flair for comedic animation and knowing how to draw creatures that put a smile on your face. This animation was very simplistic, but I actually really enjoyed it. It was such a simple and cute story as well about an alien and what they'd feel like if they came to our planet because it's not the nicest of species. It's one of those that it kind of tells it in, in a relatable way, in a very simplistic way, too, with very bright colors. The bright colors really attract, and it would actually be what attracts children, too. It's one that keeps you engaged and glued to the screen. The fact that they used a simple animation style that felt a little more hand-drawn made it a little more personal as well. It's one that felt like they were trying to tell a story about a poor alien and give, trying to get sympathy for him in the shortest amount of time as possible. It's absolutely a great, there's, there was a great design, uh, excellent, excellent work, uh, really fun. Yeah, motion graphic designer, it was brilliant. Uh, I like the story as well, how these, um, these beings, these thing comes from the space and then comes to earth and then uh, and then on, on earth um, the this this thing understands that he's like the enemy and it doesn't it, he wasn't expecting that i think there was a there was a good idea behind the film you know like kind of uh, when you expect it to to when you're expecting to be loved, you know, with, with somebody that you love, um, and then it turns out to be that, that you the one being hated. You're like, they don't love you, you know, they hate you. I think it's, it, it was very powerful to see this quick change towards the end. Kind of flashy and funny to watch all along, and the length is not that uh, much, so we got to feel like the elements in the short with the use of like sound the use of like um like foley into it which is i think it's pretty interesting like to use it in in this kind of short too and with the stop motion techniques just kind of make it feel alive to see like the character like try to stay in touch with it but eventually cannot the message is interesting and clear, and other events are well done. This really reminded me of something that you would see on Adult Swim. I mean, I loved the art and the animation style. I thought that it was really, really cool. And they created a short film that was really interesting and very, very creative. 